Good morning guys. I just put on a workout set. I was wearing these leggings and this sweater yesterday um, But I you know what everything is in bags and just like everywhere. So I was like, I'll just wear the same thing It's a different sports bra though but Anyways, I put on workout set because I feel like I can accomplish more with something like this on because I'm like super You know what I mean? Like you just feel really agile and you can just like do a lot of things like that's how i feel when i put on a workout set is i just feel like it makes me physically more productive and work harder i don't know why but i think it's just having something like a work like it's a workout set so like i'm gonna get more shit done that's just like a mental thing anyways so i'm ready to tackle the day i just had a bowl of cereal um and yeah, that's the best I can do this morning because literally our pots and everything is just like in this abyss that I need to unpack. So I think I am going to unload the dishwasher right now. The dishes that I washed yesterday are finished, so I'm going to put those away and find a place for them. And then I'm going to put in like the glassware and the Tupperwares maybe to wash those as well. Um, so I think I'm going to do that right now and I'm just going to start with that so I can just get loads um, in throughout the day. And then while that's washing, I'll like start putting away all this shit um because i really want to do um the closet today so hopefully we can get a lot of shit done here is a before i know i showed you guys yesterday but i just want to compare to what i'm going to do today so we can see the progress by the end of the day dishes are nice and clean i honestly need a step stool because these cabinets are pretty high for me like here i'm going to show you guys so me being here this is like where i open the cabinets and as you can see this is like as far as I can reach, like it's not far. So um, I think at Ikea, I'm gonna pick up a step stool because that's necessary for me. Because these ceilings are pretty high. Are these eight foot ceilings? These must be higher. Definitely gonna need a step stool because like there's there's so much good storage in this kitchen, like it literally goes all the way up. Um, but definitely gonna need a step stool. But I think I'm just gonna put the dishes like here so it's just like easy for me, you know? I'm gonna put like the necessities on the bottom shelf, obviously, because I can't literally reach the top. So I just thought that I'd show you before um, we put the box away or to the recycling. So this is the dish set that we got. Um, if you guys want to look it up on Ikea, this is it. Okay, here are the dishes. Um, they all fit perfectly right here. This is like a good amount of dishes to start off, so I don't think I'm gonna be buying more just yet. Like this is perfect amount. Um, and then right now I'm just gonna load the cups and then the wine glasses in the dishwasher and probably these um, Tupperware containers that we got too. We got these at um, Home Goods, <clears throat> and it was just on sale. It's just like a simple like glass Tupperware set. And then I also got these bowls from IKEA. Um, so if this fits, I'm going to load this in as well. This is just like for salads or whatever you want to really um, make in here. So I'm going to do that. And I just ended up putting the cutlery in here like this because we don't have a divider yet. So I need to get one of those. I'm just going to need to like measure the drawer to make sure that I get like a nice one that fits. I honestly think that I'm going to buy another cutlery set of like the exact same thing just because there's not enough like everything came with four of each i'm definitely gonna buy another set because this won't be enough but this is like really good quality cutlery it's so sick I got at least most of my clothes in here um, I did make a huge dent I honestly think this is I got every bag 
because I couldn't find another one without my clothing. This fitting into this does not look that promising, but I also do have this drawer set that um, I'm gonna get for clothing as well. So I honestly think between this and the closet, I'm gonna be able to fit everything, fingers crossed, and if I can't, then I'm going to get rid of some shit. So we'll see, I hope I can fit everything though. But I feel like it will be fine. Ah, there's just literally so much. It's like, I don't even know where to start. But we're just, we just have to start. Like, that's just what I'm going to have to do is just start. Just did this section of the closet. Um, these fit perfectly. The shirts are perfect here, so I'm really glad everything fit. I still do have like a couple more hoodies and stuff that I need to hang up. I'm probably gonna end up finding a couple more shirts as well. But anyways, this looks super good and it fits super well, so I'm really happy with that. And what is nice, I also have more hanging space on this side, and I think I'm just gonna put like dresses here. Actually, maybe I might put big jackets. I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, it's coming together. Okay, so I just added my shoe bin underneath here because I had this in my closet at home and I think it just does a really good job at storing my shoes. So I literally have all my shoes in there. They don't really need to be on display. Like I really don't care. Whenever I need shoes, I'll just pull the bin out and then get the pair that I want. And then over here, I hung my dresses and then I have my workout leggings and then my workout sports bras in here. And then in this one, I just have skirts. And yeah, I'm gonna put my jeans up here when I find them. And then not sure what I'm gonna do here yet. Probably hats, but we'll see. Okay, so I just put the containers up here. These is, this was like the pack that we bought. I love it so much. Um, I feel like they're perfect and I don't think we're gonna have to get that much more for containers. Um, I did wanna stack them with the lids on just so that when you want one, you just pull it. You don't need to like sort through it to find the lid and everything. Cause I find that to be annoying sometimes. So since we don't even have a lot, I was just like, why don't I just like put the lids on and then we'll just stack them like that. Like there's literally so much storage in these. Like look, it goes all the way up and we barely have anything. So I'm not really worried about taking up um, more space doing it this way. But yeah, these are all in. Now we got some containers and no leftover dinner to put it in yet, but there will be some soon. Okay, I'm just about to load the pans. I just put the wine glasses in and then just like dirty dishes that we were using today. And oh, and you get the champagne glasses too, but I might actually just wash this by hand. I don't know, we'll see, but I definitely want to do this today. This is the set that we got. I know this is like a good brand. And we got it at Superstore and it was on sale like $50 off. And I think we got this whole set for around like $100, which is really good. And it matches like the black theme. <laughs> so it's honestly perfect. I think I'm honestly just going to wash this by hand and then do a load of the dishwasher tonight. Because I already put the dishwasher on like twice today. So I feel like I'll just wait until later tonight to put it on again. And then wash these by hand. That is literally so cute like for eggs or something little pot this is actually like a perfect size pot for like pasta and everything 
and I'm literally in love with the black like it looks so good here's a nice um this one's bigger I guess the other one was a medium one and then this is like the big one and here is the I guess you could say regular size pan so yeah and that's so that's basically all that came in the set so here is what came in the set I'm actually in love with it like why am I excited about pots and pans right now that just means that I am old now like when you get excited about these things i just correlate it to being old but i'm actually so excited and we were gonna go with the ikea ones but the quality on those were really shitty so we were like you know what let's just wait it out and we'll find a good set and then we literally just came across this one and we were like holy shit like this is exactly what we were wanting and it's literally perfect i don't know if i'm gonna ever get more like maybe I'll get another set one day or just like buy individual like things if I ever need like anything else which I don't really think I would like I think this is all you really need but we'll see but anyways this is so sick okay so I just cleaned them and dried them I'm putting the pots right here and it's like you know you're right next to the stove and then in this drawer I just have the two pans and maybe we'll get more pans and then it'll fill up a little more but for now it's okay <laughs> Okay, we are back in the bathroom because I have another box to unload and I'm just going to like get this drawer situated so I can have it 100%. I don't even know what I have in here. Like I thought that that was like, wow. How do I have so much shit? I don't even know. Anyways, we're going to organize this drawer of mine and make it functionable. I hope you guys are back here. I just finished bathroom mostly so that feels so good and i was getting really hungry joel's actually not feeling good today like he's sick so he's just been laying in bed all day which sucks because he obviously wants to unpack as well but i'm gonna make dinner for us i'm gonna make i think just like keep it simple easy pasta my first home cooked meal i have one big decision to make do we do bow tie or macaroni Joel, do we do bow ties or macaroni? Um, I really want bow ties. Bow ties? Yeah. Okay, I'll do bow ties. And then I'm just going to use this sauce, um, tomato and basil. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, and then I think I'm just going to make a salad with it. Yay, I'm actually so excited cooking for the first time. Like, this is a little bit monumental. Oh my god, wait. But this is a cool camera angle, though. This is a cool angle. I can't wait till everything is like we get the couch. Like I'm literally so excited to get the couch and like put the TV so we can have like movie nights. Oh, like I can't wait. Um. Anyways, okay. This fan is so cool. Also got these salt um, shakers. I got one pepper too from Costco, and this is just like a refill. And then you just like it's like a clapper one. Costco honestly has such good prices on things like yes you buy in bulk so technically you're paying a little more but like for the amount you get and everything it's like night and day but you got to be careful because it's literally so easy to spend money in there Woo! first time firing the stove up that's exciting yay oh my god this is so exciting like i'm cooking in my own place this is our place this is our place like my own place that's insane i am literally so excited to be sharing this journey with you guys like i realized how important it is to share so much more than just like oh this is what i'm wearing today this is what i'm doing today like share so much more than like surface level things on this channel because that's life like i want i want people to be able to like connect with me and to watch my videos because they can relate they can learn something and you know what i mean i just can't do service level stuff anymore i love going deep like ever since i had like a spiritual awakening i just i feel like it's so important that like deep can making deep connections is so meaningful and talking about deep things is also so meaningful and that's why I want to share everything with you guys. Like literally just like document my life, like everything. Like we are spiritual beings on this human experience. 
and like just thinking about that is crazy um i just wanted to basically say that like i'm just so excited to start sharing more deep things like deep things about life life talks meaningful talks deep talks I literally that's like my favorite thing to do like when somebody can't go deep with me i'm just like can't relate to them as much you know